Hello everyone, this is Ashish Sunny from Innovate Yourself. Welcome back to my channel. Once again, I am back with another video on Rasa Chatbot. And in today's session, we will be using the latest model of Rasa Chatbot, which is Rasa 2.7. So we will be using the latest model for that. And with this latest version, what we are going to do today is I'm going to show you that how you can build your chatbot with Rasa chatbot in Hindi language. So in short, your chatbot will be uh, talking to you in the Hindi language. So whatever text you will give to the chatbot as an input that will be in the Hindi language. So you will be giving your chatbot an input in Hindi language and accordingly your chatbot will reply you back in Hindi language itself. So that is all that we will be learning in today's session. Now let's straight forward go to the project and let's understand the project which is really really helpful for all the people who are in India because everyone knows Hindi language in India. So let's straight forward go to the project. So let's get started. All right, so you can see I have already built a new project. In fact, uh, this is a completely uh, blank project right now because we don't have any file over here. So right now, let me show you what exactly we're gonna do in here is firstly, I will be creating a virtual environment in which I will be having the latest version of Raza. So I don't want to waste the time for the installation part. So that's the reason I have already done the installation and this is the virtual environment which I have already activated. So now we can see the version for Rasa is Rasa 2.7.1 so this is the latest version which we have right now so I'm gonna use that and the Python version which I'm using is which is 3.8.6 and the Rasa X version is 0.41 which is also the latest one so I'm working on this so based on that now we can further proceed right and currently I'm using the operating system as Linux or you can say the Ubuntu system so that's the reason you must be having a, a visualization like this right now let's uh, start the project by uh, building the initial project so in the initial you will have to perform the same thing which is like rasa init uh, hyphen hyphen no hyphen prompt so you will be running that and once you will have the project ready for the initial project then we can further start with the uh, a language changing part right because initially with the by default language you will have the project or let's say you will have the rasa project in english language but we have to make it with hindi language so that's all that i will show you first uh, let the training get complete uh, for the initial project so let's wait for it to finish Alright, so now you can see the initial project is ready with us and uh, it is trained for the initial project. Right now in here we can see that uh, all the files are created right now. Now as I have said that currently the project is in the English language and that you can verify in here that uh, everything is inside uh, over here with this language. Right, so this is the English language completely. So in this way we have the project. Now the name for your intent, the name for your entity, that's all your choice because that's a, like a static thing. So that doesn't matter like in which language you have written, but the most important thing is the input and the output that you are going to generate and the complete processing that you're going to do uh, and that will be done based on the language model that you have selected, right? So based on that, you have to do it. But where do we select the language model over here and how do we insert that part right so that's all that we will be doing in here right so for that you need to go to config.yml so in the configuration file you will see over here you have the language selected over here in line number three as english or let's say this is a two word or let's say two digit uh, letter for the language or let's say this is a two digit code for the language and that is en so en is what for english so in this way currently we're using the english language that's why we have it in english format but if you want to change it to some other language then we will be changing it to some other language and as i said like in a today's session we will be working on the hindi language so that's the reason i will be changing the language code to some other part or let's say to the hindi part so hi hi is the language for hindi so in the similar way if you're working on hindi language you're typing hi over here if you are using some other language then you will be typing the two digit code for that particular language so in this way we can have it right so this is all about it and uh, there is one more modification in the latest model for that and let me show you what exactly that is 
लाइक ओवर है यू कैन सी आई हैव ओपन वन वेबसाइट फ्रॉम द स्पेसी बिकॉज स्पेसी सपोर्ट्स सम ऑफ द लैंग्वेजेस दैट यू कैन यूज ओवर है राइट नाउ यू कैन सी ओवर है देर इज अ लिस्ट ऑफ ऑल द लैंग्वेजेस दैट स्पेसी सपोर्ट्स एंड इन फैक्ट दैट इज जस्ट uh as per the latest model of spacey which is spacey 3.0 so this is as per the latest version so as per that these are the languages which uh, spacey supports and we can directly download it and we can use it from here right so currently we are using the english language so that's the reason you must know like we are using this model or let's say this pre trained model for the english language so if you want to use some other language let's say spanish russian or whichever you want to use you will see it is going to change as for that so this is how we will be downloading it so that means if you want to download it for the language which you are using right now in that case we will be simply running this command into the virtual environment which you are working right now so if you are working uh, for the spanish language you have to run this command over here and you need to install it right so in this way you will be installing it and then you can further uh, use that part and in this case you don't need to let's say link the model with the language that you're going to use instead as per the latest model what we will be doing is we will be simply passing this complete name and this complete name is also supported over here as per the latest version so you just need to copy this and add it over here instead of this right you can type this as well as you can type the two digit code as well that's your choice but in my case i'm going to use hindi and right now i'm not going to add any model over here because Uh, for hindi we don't have much models available so that's the reason we are going to use it uh, in the direct format right but how i'm going to get the results for that so that i will be telling you right now like how you will be getting it so currently i have just changed the two digit code for the language that's what i have done now you can uh, set up like what pipeline do you require what policies do you require you can comment and uncomment that part as per your suitability right so this is what i have done in the similar way now as you can see in here in here you have the uh, complete nlu data in the english format so we need to uh, convert this similarly in the domain also we have the complete data in the different format and different format is what that different format is english language so we need to change it into hindi language as well so this is how we are going to do it so once i will be doing it then i will show you like how it will look like so let me do one thing let me first of all convert this uh from uh, english to hindi language so to convert the complete text from english to hindi what you can do is you can simply uh like either type the complete text in the hindi language or you can simply use the google translator like over here you can see i have the google translator over here you can simply type like uh, i am sad for example so it will give you the reply for that so in this way we will be updating it like for example this is hey how are you so you can simply type it here and are aap kaise hain so in this way you can uh, get this part right so let me just first of all modify this let me first of all completely change the text from english to hindi so that uh, i can use it with the uh, project right so let me do it for you all right so now can you see like i have converted the complete text from uh, english to hindi like uh, here you can see all the uh, words are in hindi language now so we can write it like this and in the similar way in the domain also i have changed it to hindi language right so input will be in the hindi language and output will also be in the hindi language so in this way we will be getting the result right so this is all that i have done right now and in this way now when i will talk to the bot and in fact you can say when you will train the model you will be getting the result for the uh, trained model for that in in the similar way when you will be talking to the bot you will be getting a reply in hindi language as per what input you are going to give right so this is how we will be doing it so currently as you can see like uh, intents are already in the english language only just because i haven't changed it because as i have already said in the beginning that uh, uh, these are just the name doesn't matter whether you type it in hindi english or whatever other language you prefer so that is going to be a static thing or let's say that is just a labeling for the classification that you will be doing based on the inputs that you have provided so that is just a name that doesn't matter like in which language you have provided that so that's the reason i haven't changed the names i have just changed the text like whatever will be the input whatever will be the output so this is what i have done now i have done all the things now the next thing is i just need to train the model so for that let me first of all train the model with the hindi text completely right so let me run it now and once the model gets trained i will show you like how it's going to reply you back when you will be talking to the bot onto the rasa x right 
uh, okay so there is something uh, that's not working right now let me see uh, it's text in line number 14 okay let's see oh okay uh, the problem is in here uh, okay it's just the indentation problem anyways no issues now I have corrected that all right so now the model has been trained now we can talk to the bot but as i said that we will be talking to the bot on the front end part and that is rasa x so let me run rasa x for you all right so now the rasa x is up and running now we can go in here and talk to the bot okay like uh, it's uh, loading right now wait for it to load completely okay so the model is trained and now you can talk to the bot over here right so let me first of all say some hello or something but instead of saying hi or hello i just want to say the text in hindi language right so let me first of all use the google translator over here let's say hello so that means namaste so we will simply say namaste over here and as you know like currently we have a mood bot so in which it will be uh, giving you the reply as per your mood right so that's the reason we are talking to uh, the bot in this way so it's like are aap kaise hain so let's say i'm sad right for example i am sad right so main dukhi hu right so just copy this and let's try it here can you see uh like yahan aapko utsahit karne ke liye kuch hai kya isse aapko madad mili so it's like they have shown you one image and in that image you have a, a small tiger right so it's a very beautiful image that you can see like and so definitely it's going to change your mood right so it is about that now kya isse aapko madad mili let's say uh, for example yes but i want to say it in hindi ha right so let me type it so badhiya jari rakho so it's like this is a small conversation that we have made to our chatbot in hindi language so in the similar way if you're going to make your chatbot in different language i have already shown you that you have different other models and whichever model you will be selecting and just change the model as per that and accordingly add it into the uh, configuration file and then just train the model so in this way we can do it but currently we have made it work as per the hindi language and i hope now you have got a proper understanding like how you can build your chatbot in hindi so that you can perform whatever you want to do and in fact we can say now you can perform or you can make your chatbot in the preferred language that you are going to make for so this is all about that so i hope now everything is clear to you but still if you are facing any difficulties in uh, uh, building your chatbot in hindi or any language feel free to leave a comment below in the comment section and also if you are new to our channel and if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet please please click on the subscribe button so that you do not miss any videos from our channel because I continuously and in fact my team continuously keep sharing the knowledge regarding the new topics and in fact the topics that are really really helpful for you as per the industrial standards so don't forget to uh, hit the subscribe button so that you will be blessed with a very great career ahead and if you have liked this video do click on the like button and if you have find this video useful then do share this video with everyone so that is all for today till then bye bye and happy learning